about science, it's made the modern world. Science is. is under attack. The very idea of evidence and logic and reason is being threatened by individuals and interests with the power to do real harm. We are gathered here today to fight for science. Science should need no defense, but it's great to see so many science defenders willing to stand up, speak out, and march for science. Show the world that science is for all. Our lawmakers must know and accept that science serves every one of us, every citizen of every nation and society. Science must shape policy. Science is universal. Science brings out the best in us with an informed, optimistic view of the future. Together, we can, dare I say it, save the world! <laughs> Center tweeted a picture of themselves holding a sign with a quote from chemist Marie Curie. It read, quote, nothing in life is to be feared, it is only to be understood. Now is the time to understand more so, so that we may fear less. The first ever March for Science coincided with Earth Day and comes as President Donald Trump has galvanized scientists, educators and others with his comments calling climate change a Chinese hoax. Meanwhile, the White House's proposed budget would cut as much as $7 billion in science funding, including the National Institutes of Health, which funds medical research. Democracy Now! is at the March for Science in Washington, D.C., where thousands braved a stormy day to gather at the Washington Monument to hear speakers. You can watch our full-hour, five-hour broadcast at democracynow.org. Today, we bring you some of the... It's also Earth Day, which is expected to be observed in dozens of countries around the world and marks the one-year anniversary of the signing of the Paris Climate Change Agreement, in which President Trump has threatened to pull out of.